In this video, we will take a look at using the boundary tool. So I have imported this graphic, and if I wanted to engrave it in something and then cut it out, I have two options. I can create a box around it, turn that into a red hairline, and this way when I engrave this ballerina, it will now be cut out in a rectangular format. But what if I don't want that? What if I want something cut out to the, to the exact shape of the ballerina? If I click on the graphic and just right click, I've created an outline, but it has outlined every single line or curve in my image. I don't want that. I just want the exterior to have a red hairline. So I'll use the boundary tool inside the shaping docker. If your shaping docker is not appearing, you can go to window, dockers, and down to shaping. And it appears over here on the right side. So I select my item, I click this drop down and select boundary and apply. Now the outline that comes in is black, so let me go ahead and right click it, turn it red, and to a hairline, and I'll focus in here. You can see now there is a red hairline just around the very exterior of the graphic and not any of these interior lines. So now I can get a nice clean cut ballerina, the exact shape of my image. And that is how you use the boundary tool. For more information or to sign up for your free trial, visit laserU.com.